30 clubs in 15 days from Jupiter, Florida. We're with the Miami Marlins. Uh, we caught up with Skip Schumacher earlier, and we asked him about the health of his rotation. Yeah, our rotation, you know, honestly, missing Sandy in those innings is going to be tough, his leadership. Um, but you'll also see Sandy in every bullpen behind Yuri Perez, behind Lizardo, behind yeah. some of the young guys, um, and mentoring him and them. Um, and when you have Yuri Perez um, as kind of the next guy up, with Lizardo being our opening day guy, you feel pretty good about your, you know, number one and twos. I went in a cage early, was talking to some guys, and name I heard was A.J. Puck. Seems to be transitioning the starter seamlessly. Yeah, he has been a starter his whole life. Yeah, and then he got hurt. And Bully. Exactly. And then we needed, you know, a back end bullpen leverage guy last year and AJ was that guy and he was really successful at it. Um, talked to him in the offseason. He's been wanting to start for a number of years. And now with Sandy's injury, he's got that opportunity. And all he's done is gone three, four score lists and thrown strikes and uh, developed a two seamer with some, you know, real depth and a split off of that. We know he has the sweeper. So he's got four pitches that he can work with. Big, strong, looks the part. Yeah. Um, so it's so far so good. All right, take us through your lineup. You worried about scoring runs? Do you like what you see so far? I think you're always worried about scoring yeah. runs, right? Uh, the pitching nowadays is insane. Um, there's velo everywhere. So of course you're always concerned. I think most managers probably are trying to figure out how to score runs. But when you have a batting champ at the top, yeah. um, feels like he's on base every other time. Um, 500 clip, you know, seriously, it's insane. Um, you have him and then you acquire a batting champ, an ex batting champ, yeah. a TA, which a motivated one, incredibly, incredibly motivated. And there's no fluff to this guy. Like he is working to get back to where he wants to be um, a full season of Bell and Berger. But you also want guys to start stepping up, right? It's and, time uh, for Jazz. Jazz. Um, it, it, getting him to play 140, 150 um, is going to be the key to to us and for, and for him. How's T.A. been? T.A.'s been incredible. I mean, I, I really, uh, you know, we didn't really know. It sounds what we like the guys do. have uh, really gravitated to him and kind of, you know, grown to really like him in a short period of time. Yeah, no doubt. You know, we've had, you know, a couple good options over there and John Birdie and X yeah. Edwards is coming up and John Birdie's a baseball player. So I can feel like I can put him in anywhere and, and be just fine. But T.A. could be that difference maker in our lineup. Um, you know, we don't have Solaire this year. So that those that run production is going to have to come up, uh, come from somebody and a guy like T.A who uh, knows that last year was an outlier year and he feels like he's back to where he needs to be. You know, we don't have your legs hitting. It's tough to hit. Right. And uh, he was injured and he feels like he's got his base underneath him. And so, uh, so we're excited where he's at. We'll get you out of here on this one. Let's talk about the young man that pitched yesterday um, and, and, the, and the possibility that, that Max can, can help you guys yeah, at, right. at some point. He's had to overcome some injuries as well. Uh, what has he looked like this spring? Well, he's got some edge to him. I know that. Um, he has the ninth inning closer mentality as a starter. And uh, it's tough to find that edge or to create edge in a player. Either you got it or you don't. Yeah. And uh, you can't uh, impose your will on players, right? And he's got it. Um, now it's just building him up, being, uh, if it's not breaking camp with us, being a real viable option for us later down the road because you don't just have five sure. starters Correct. during the year. Um, but to have someone like that, you know, waiting in the wing is, is a pretty nice uh, option to have.